today's video i'll be telling you guys all the tips and tricks to make sure you look fly and fine and a baddie all christmas and winter long hey guys welcome to the video we are Christmas ready on this channel. We are officially in winter. We've been in winter, but here in Texas, we just got into the 40 degree and under temperature. So my Christmas starts now. If you're new here in April, I'm a cosmetic and skincare chemist. I talk about all things skincare, back end, front end of all things skincare. So if you're interested in science based skincare, make sure to hit that like button down below. Join the family. We're here every week talking about skincare. So you don't want to be missing in action. You're going to have FOMO. So join the family. All right, as so you guys can tell from the title, we're talking about winter skincare, Christmas skincare routine, skincare routine for the holidays. You guys, uh, I know this holiday season, we're gonna be busy buying gifts if you have coins, cause <laughs> this year, this year ain't it. Anyway, so winter. When winter comes around, the humidity in the air drops so low where it becomes so dry that the air actually starts to pull water from your skin. Remember, from biology, osmosis, area of higher concentration to area of lower concentration. So your skin actually starts to lose water to the atmosphere. So it makes our skin what? Dry, so dry that you can start to look flaky, dusty, and we do not want to look dusty. 2020 is a whole dusty year. We do not want to look like the year 2020. We want to look like we slayed quarantine, like we came out on top, like we a bad bitch. You feel me? <laughs> so in today's video, I'll be telling you guys all the tips and tricks to make sure you look fly and fine and a baddie all Christmas and winter long. Let's get into the video. So as I said, a low humidity in the air, meaning dry skin. So we want to tackle this. If you have dry skin, you have underperforming sebaceous glands. I talk more about dry skin in a video where I recommended a lot of products actually from the drugstore to you guys up here. So you can check, feel free to check that out. And if you have oily skin, you have overperforming sebaceous glands. Both skin types can be really dry in the winter because the humidity is so low and the air is cold. So like I said, dry skin, but also so a lot of people with oily skin will find that they have uh, dehydrated skin because your skin actually starts to lose a lot of water. So the oiliness in your skin tries to compensate for it, making their skin even oilier, but they really are dehydrated, not oily. This can also be due to your skin not being able to hold on enough water or just increased trans water loss can also cause this to happen. So for this winter time, we want to remember to drink lots of water and mind your business. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Drink your water. Mind your business too. But drink water. We want to use a lot of humectants. So a lot of products that contain hydrated ingredients. I talked about humectants in a video up here. You can feel free to check it out. Other humectants you might want to consider this season are things like hyaluronic acid, urea, propanol, and glycerin. And also you're going to want some emollients to help seal in that hyaluronic acid or humectant that you've applied on the skin. You want something like scolane, ceramide, jojoba oil. These ingredients will help seal in that moisture and prevent the water they're going to be losing the season from evaporating into the atmosphere. So definitely, definitely, definitely invest in humectants and hydrating products this season. For moisturizer, you do want to use a hydrating moisturizer. Let go of your exfoliating moisturizers for right now. Even moisturizers that contain too high of BHAs and AHAs because they could probably further dry you out. You want to invest in gentle hydrating moisturizers because again, we want to ensure our skin is holding onto water. Make sure you're using a hydrating serum, a lip balm. A really good one I love is the one from Laneige. Ugh, obsessed with that lip balm also if you have if you get really dry under eye because the area around the eye is the thinnest skin area so it will lose water faster than the rest of our face and the rest of our skin definitely invest in a good eye cream as well as don't forget your sunscreen this season i know a lot of you guys are going to try to skip out on that sunscreen because it's getting darker out really quick you guys are thinking the sun isn't out nope the sun is just as much out as it is when it's really hot outside so don't forget your sunscreens but yeah that's it for this video i hope you guys enjoyed it let me know if you enjoyed this video by commenting down below like this video smash that like button it really helps me out and tell a lot more sisters what to do with their skin this winter all right i'm not gonna hold you guys any longer don't forget to moisturize and hydrate see you guys next time bye